Welcome back to some more Crash Nitro Kart. In this one we're going to do Clockwork Wampa and try and get all the boxes. Hopefully if I don't uh, crash into too many stuff. Uh, I've decided to go Crash Bandicoot on this one because of the placement of the boxes and uh, it's sometimes very hard to grab these boxes uh, with uh, Crunch Bandicoot due to the amount of turning that you've got to do. And there's a lot of jumping that you need to perform as well, which is sometimes difficult. Alright, just grabbing these boxes now, and uh, at the moment got 18 seconds on the clock. I mean, need to beat 2 minutes and 30 seconds to get a Sapphire Relic. And gold is around about, is around about 2 minutes and 10, while the uh, platinum I believe is around 2 minutes, so... As long as we hit the two minute mark, we should be all good. Alright, managed to dodge the uh, gong there. And we started off the first lap pretty well with 32 seconds. No mistakes so far, which is good. And I'm on lap 2 with 24 out of 51 boxes. Alright, gotta watch out for the gears. Right, I'm just going to grab this box here for a bit of uh, technical manoeuvres and then I'm going to uh, grab that very hard to claim box over there because that's the longest one to grab. Alright for the final lap I need to uh, make sure I get enough speed to hit all those uh, boxes in a row without slowing down too much. I have to slow down a bit before so I can get some momentum going. Alright, let's see if I can hit that jump. Oh, come on! Missed that again twice in a row. Hopefully I can hit it on the uh, third go, otherwise I'll be in trouble. <laughs> Alright, I think I've got en just enough speed to hit that number three crate. Yes, I do. Alright, hit that uh, crate there just and uh, just managed to avoid that little gong thing. Alright, final lap and 1 minute and 27 seconds. Uh, I've had two hits with the uh, shortcut there, but it uh, shouldn't slow me down too much. As long as I nail this on the third attempt. Alright, so far I've hit uh, 41 out of 50, 44 out of 51. Oh, come on, really? Oh no. Be more careful next time. Oh, this is gonna cost me uh, about six seconds. <laughs> Alright. One minute and fifty-three seconds. Uh need to beat two minutes and thirty. So we should be able to beat that easily. Oh yeah, we made it up on that shortcut this time. Alright, 2 minutes and 11 so far. Just going to niftily grab that number 3 crate and then hit that 2 crate for the ending. Ha ha ha, 2 minutes 07. If I didn't uh, miss that box, I would have had the platinum time on that one. But it's all good. <laughs> Golden is uh, satisfying enough. So 7.45 away from uh, gold due to a slightly mistimed jump and a smash in the wall. Now I'm going to go for the CNK for this one now. Should be a little bit easier but Super job. You. there's a very very difficult letter near the end of the race and, in the, and you're required to do a very small jump. If you over jump it, then you won't be able to grab it. And if you under jump it, you won't be able to grab it. So you've got to like time it perfectly. I think this is was fixed in the PS2 version, but not the version that I'm playing. Where you've got to jump like hardly anything at all, but you somehow got to hit that uh, final letter, which will be difficult. <laughs> Alright, so 
first leader is coming up is on the uh, gears. It's on one of those uh, free moving gears up ahead. Uh, once Coco gets them away, I'll be able to grab it. Alright, the sea is right there, so I'm going to go real high and grab it. The end is on the next jump, which is on that uh, shortcut. So we just got to uh, power slide through here and hopefully uh, make it, which we didn't. <laughs> I'm not going to use my uh, team up thing yet, I'm going to save that for later. Alright, this is a, this last letter is the hardest to grab, and you go very slow, oh come on, and grab it. Alright, let's try this again. Oh come on, really, alright, I'm going to restart this I think. One more time though. <laughs> I want to get that K. Uh, Alright, this time I'm restarting. <laughs> if I miss it more than three times in a row, then uh, the opponent get too far ahead and it's almost impossible to catch back up. So, so that's why I decided three times trying to get the K. If I don't get it, then I will restart. Which, uh, hopefully this time it goes better. And I don't need to restart again. Alright, I see the sea. <laughs> if you get what I mean. And I've gotten it. I might actually uh, try and grab that K for the second lap. Alright, I'm definitely not going to make it up there. I will try though. <laughs> Let's see if I can get that K. Oh no, I over jumped it. Uh, I'm going to try get it, getting it on the second lap. If I don't get it on the second lap, then I will have to restart the uh, race again. Oh, that K is definitely a, the difficult uh, letter in the bunch. Oh, I think I uh, knocked someone off there. No peeking yet. I'm not sure how Coco passed me like that, but she did. <laughs> the race is mine. The race is Cortex's. <laughs> oh, whoops! I got myself somehow. <laughs> I will be more careful next time. Oh, there we go. Perfect. Oh, I missed the end though. Need to go back for it. Alright, I'm making progress. Just go get the K and then win the race. Oh, luckily I had that shield. Alright, I'm gonna... I only have one chance to hit that K. Ah, oh, I failed it. Wrong way. Okay. Try again. Nah, I'm not gonna get it in time. Because I need at least uh, half a lap to catch back up. <laughs> Alright, third time should be the charm though. Hopefully I can get all three letters in one go so I don't have to worry about this on lap two and three. Because I need to focus my energy on actually uh, winning the race instead of uh, collecting the letters. But collecting the letters first and then winning the race at the end will be my strategy. Alright, going for C, C now. Alright, got the C. Oh, got my teammate somehow. <laughs> uh, sorry uh, about that teammate, but I've got to be behind so I can uh, use you later. <laughs> Alright, got the N as well. Hopefully I can grab the K in sweet succession. Oh, I nearly got it. Okay, I think I got the strategy. Don't jump. 
I think the don't jump strategy is going to work for me. So once I hit see that uh, jump, I won't uh, jump it. I'll just let it glide over and hopefully that lets me uh, nail that K in time. I'll take my chances and uh, do another lap. Seems like I've got some good momentum for this uh, for this one. Well, my teammate sort of ran it into my own uh, shield, so it's not my fault that I uh, attacked it. <laughs> oh, come on, I did the same mistake again. I thought I could jump over the jump, but obviously I wasn't fast enough. Oh, nailed the shortcut again. And I'm in the lead of the tornado. Alright, no jumping. Yes! Coco, thank you very much. I don't know why, but my teammate helped me uh, hit that K. But very, very hard to nail K. And we're in first place now. <laughs> Oh man, I'm gonna call this episode Thank You Teammate. <laughs> oh man, I was not expecting that to happen. <laughs> oh man, so lucky. Oh, Coco was just in the perfect position to just ram her and then uh, slow down just enough to get that uh, K. <laughs> now, all we've got to focus on now is winning the race, and we do have a nice lead, so. As long as we don't uh, mess up and trap our sails, we should be all good. Oh yeah, we've got enough to extend the gap even more. Now we've just got to power ourselves to victory. Power slide ourselves to victory. Oh, hit the gong. Never mind, I'm, I've got a big massive gap. Cortex shouldn't catch me. Alright! CNK token challenge complete. Thanks to my teammate. <laughs> Alright. Pretty happy about how that went. That uh, third and final attempt. Now we're going on to another race track. And we're going to do the uh, relic stage first in it. Wonderful. Alright, so I've got 11 uh, CMK tokens, we've got 9 relics, and we've got all the boss keys, so what we're going to do now is travel to the final area and collect all the remaining items from here. There's also a, uh, another one that I haven't actually done yet inside the uh, ice area. We'll end up doing that uh, a bit later. Alright, assembly lane first. And there's 50 boxes in this one. Oh, I uh, missed the uh, crate there, never mind. Oh yeah, good start so far, we can use crunch on this one because we need a lot of speed to hit those uh, boxes. It's going to do a uh, practice lap first, just get the feel of the track, and then uh, after I had a little practice run I'll be able to do this uh, track pretty well. Need a lot of speed to hit those uh, slammer things. Oh, I uh, definitely need practice grabbing those uh, difficult to grab crates. There we go. Alright, it's going to practice the uh, other jump as well up ahead, and then we'll restart the uh, track to uh, do it properly. Alright, so this. So this uh, shortcut that I need to practice is uh, just up ahead and you need to hit this uh, free crate in the correct location in order to uh, obtain it. Alright, gonna try and take the shortcut now. Oh, missed the crate though, never mind. I'll restart 
and we'll uh, do it properly since we know all the crates are and how to grab them. So I'm going to take the shortcut crate first, I think, or second. Haven't decided yet. Oh yeah, nailed that two crate. And that three crate as well. Alright, I'm going to take the shortcut crate now. Oh yeah, perfect. Hit all those boxes in a row there. This is a way better start than before. Uh, it should have enough speed just to bounce up there. I'm just going to quickly uh, reverse and grab the other crate. Just had enough speed to uh, jump over the uh, platform there. And now we're just going to cruise and uh, nail all the boxes. Alright, we need to uh, carefully drive around here until we hit two crates down below. Whoops, I sort of messed it up a little bit. Didn't mind. Alright, I recommend hitting the free crate first. And then hitting the next free crate. Alright. I should have another gold relic on this one. If I uh, play it right. Oh, I just missed the one crate there, never mind. Not too disastrous. Alright, 49 seconds and uh, we're on the second lap. Alright, we're moving that uh, platform out of the way because we don't need to use it anymore. Oh, just uh, slammed into the wall there. Alright, just going to do a quick uh, handbrake turn there and uh, hit those next boxes. Boxes on the jumps I'll take for last and hopefully we don't uh, have too much drama with them. Alright, there should be another crate down here and one more across this direction. Now we can start power sliding and uh, hitting that next number crate. Alright, final lap, 1 minute and 22 seconds. We're on target for a golden relic here. Oh yeah. There we go. Alright, we need to do a, whoa, a, a special jump here. Holding down brake while jumping sometimes gives you a slight uh, boost of control. And you can hit two boxes with it if you m m miss a box like earlier. Alright, I don't want to hit that crate, but I do want to hit that one crate. Alright, trying to hit that two crate here and quickly jump back here in case I get squished. Alright, 35 seconds left to beat this uh, level. Oh yeah, nailed that jump perfectly, and the other one. Alright. Good, good possibility of a golden relic here. We can just uh, power along through because there's no other boxes until the final box right at the end. We hit all 50 boxes just now and we get a a sweet golden relic of 2 minutes and 6.97. Pretty happy with that result. And the final race of the episode will be the CMK challenge for this track, which is fairly easy, to be honest. It's not that difficult. All you got to do is just uh, make sure you nail those Good jumps job. again. You've won a relic. And you should be all good. There's also that shortcut that you got to nail that we did in uh, the... Uh, relic stage as well where that free crate was there's a there is a token there to grab so we're going to grab that first if we can if, if we miss it we can grab it on the second lap <laughs> nice 
na 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 <laughs> All right, first place at the moment, and we've got the C already. The C is the very easiest uh, token to grab. The N is on the shortcut. I'll grab that on the second lap, I reckon. If I miss it, then I'll be surprised, but I shouldn't uh, miss it too much. All right, just going to go through this uh, speedy shortcut here and uh, gain lots of momentum. All right, the K is, the, is it on a very, very difficult corner, and it's kind of hard to grab without falling off. So just going to reverse, grab it, jump off, and then continue. That's the uh, only way I can uh, think of, of on how to get that. All we've got to do now is catch back up, which uh, we have plenty of time to do. And then we'll be able to grab that final uh, letter. Hopefully we don't overjump the letter though, because <laughs> we're uh, quite far ahead. As you can tell, I use the uh, team boost uh, in order to keep my uh, game alive. Oh, yes, I got the end. All right, we're in second place now. Uh, Tiny's in the lead somehow. I want to hit him with a missile, and we're in first place. And we've got a good lead as well, so hopefully we can just uh, extend that because I'm quite good at this type of track. Alright. Getting towards the final lap now, and uh, we've got all the letters, we just got to win. I've got a nice uh, gap against Coco here and uh, Tiny's pretty much fallen behind as well so I've just got to keep lots of speed up and uh, hopefully win. I tried to take the shortcut again but uh, I got a bit too cocky and missed. <laughs> Never mind. Uh, might as well take the uh, shortcut again while I'm at it. Since I've got a shield. Luckily those stompers didn't even hit me and we're miles ahead now. Looks like we're on the home straight and that will be the uh, episode complete for this uh, part of Team Good. Thank you very much for watching and uh, hope you enjoyed the races.